Welcome to the new Civilization game, Beyond Earth. I put so many hours in, into Civ 5, and I'm just so excited for this game. I cannot explain. But let's jump straight into it. If you're excited to see some more of these episodes, hit the thumbs up button. Let's try and get 3,000 likes, and I'll put out the next episode as quick as possible, I promise. Um, also, there'll be a giveaway in the description below, so click those links and stuff, and yeah, it'll be like through Twitter. You can't do giveaways on like YouTube and stuff, so I'm uh, being very, very careful. So yeah, follow that. I'm giving away two copies. Um, it will run for about seven days. So once seven days is up, I'll send you the codes. I'll DM you and stuff, and um, I'll be giving two away, which is pretty awesome. So let's jump straight into single player, and let's fight some aliens. Um. <laughs> so this game is very different to like Civ Five. It's you don't pick like a country. It's like four different steps we go through. So we've got colonists. We then have spacecraft, and we also have cargo, and we've got like uh, sponsors, what you want to call them. So you can sort of see, see like a similarity because we've got Asia, we've got like France, got like a sort of Russian one there as well, um, Brazil, and sort of Africa. But we're gonna go through them a little bit. I'm not really sure what the ARC do. Yeah, I'm not really sure what that really means. So <laughs> I'm. Let's start this episode off. This is like really my first proper game, so I will do perhaps like a, a season two or something, or like a second second game. I'm very much like new to this this Beyond Earth. Just so you guys know, I took the game just now. I'm excited. I want to play it. I want to record with you guys. That's what I've done. Um, so I've got Asia, a Pan Asia, plus 10 production towards Wonders. Don't know much about the Wonders in this game yet, but that sounds very useful. And plus 25% worker speed. Worker speed is how quick they work on the tiles. Very nice. Um, got free. It's a gain of free technology for every 10 virtues. Virtues are similar sort of social policies so that's very useful virtues are quite important though the game is is you want to focus on that quite a bit um orbital units stay in orbit for 20 percent longer and what's this and the first one launched grants a free technology oh look, that's pretty awesome actually that's that's very cool right plus two trade routes um for the capital cities and outposts acquire new tiles twice as fast very nice units have 10 percent strength in melee combat melee combat's Pretty useful at the start of the game. I'm not sure it's going to be that important later on in the game. Um, the African Union. Plus 10% food in growing cities with like health. So health is another aspect of this game as well, which is brand new. I'm going to go with plus 10 virtues. Get free, te free technology. That sounds epic. So we pick the colonists. So this is the sort of colonists that will arrive. So when we when we come down, this is the guys that will be inside the pods or whatever you want to call it. The ships, the aircrafts. Um... I love science, I love pushing science, I love getting the new technologies nice and quick. So I'm pretty good with that. We've got refugees, um, aristocrats, plus free energy, plus one health in every city. That sounds pretty nice. Energy is the new gold in this game. Gold doesn't exist. It's all about energy, 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 energy. Um, production in every city, um, plus two culture, and plus one health for artists. I'm going to go with scientists, because that's what I'm going to go with. <laughs> um, next one is the spacecraft we land in. So... This had diff different sort of benefits at the start of the game. So you got like this. It's all like this all like beginning game bits. So you get to reveal the coast. The next one is retrograde thrusters. Um, so when you start the game, you've got like a small area, like a red line, where you can select where you're going to move your city into. This makes the line bigger, so you can decide more like where you're going to go first, which is very nice. Fusion reactor will give you 100 energy at the start, so you can like perhaps purchase some stuff, which is nice. Or you've got life form sensor, which reveals the alien nests on the planet um it's not too bad but you get like it's just like there's dots around the whole map so it's it's useful but it all depends if they're near you it's very it's very useful but they're not they're pretty pointless um so for me it's either the retrograde thrusters or the scanners i'll go with the retrograde thrusters i think that's the, i think that's a good one to go with I think that's probably the best one to go with right so this is the cargo we have so we can um have extra population on your first city which is it's okay it's not the best is it um get a free technology with the laboratory raw materials you get a weapon arsenal or machinery um so you might say begin with like a work unit or you get a free clinic with raw materials i'm gonna go with workers i love having workers at the start i think that's a good thing to go with we can start working straight away sounds good to me and um, let's pick a planet you heard me right pick a planet um, or a world, I guess you might call it. So this is, I guess, the basic sort of Earth-ish world. So you've got like little bits of islands around, and you've got a bit of coast. Uh, this is like one solid mass of islands with some small stuff around as well. 
This is loads of like little small islands, it's little small islands around the around the world. Got more advanced ones here as well. But for now, we're gonna stick with this one. Let's do this. Let's start this baby up. Oh my god, we're in. It's like a deserty area. Ooh, very nice. So this is some of the resources. Sorry if I say somebody's wrong or I make a mistake. Again, this is my first attempt at the game and stuff, so I'll probably say. I don't know, I say stuff wrong probably, like I pronounce it wrong and all that crap. But anyway, uh, we've got some fruit. Oh, some fruit. I can say that perfectly fine. Um, we've got some fungus. Um, float stone. Also got some copper over here. Um, some more stone, fruit, exomass. You may see this like gassy stuff here. This gas will actually damage us. If we stay in this gas for too long, um, so every, every turn you stay inside it, it minuses 10 HP to your health. So it's pretty essential you try and avoid that. Um, I'm seeing some quite... Some, these, these mountains can offer us some good defense, that's for sure. So perhaps we can stick it up here. Um, but there's a lot of resources around here, so... I don't know. I don't know what to go with. Um, got some other stuff up here as well. Look at, ooh, a derelict set, uh, settlement. Um, usual exp explorer unit to explore this. Um, uncover with some rewards. Oh, very nice. Okay, perhaps we'll go there first. Because we can go, again, it's similar to Civ 5. You can go, you can get within three tiles, so I can get this stuff. Perhaps going here would be quite good. I can sort of have units up here to defend. Let's go here. Boom. Stein up. Yes. Oh, God, I'm nervous. So nervous. We have landed. That's pretty awesome. I like it. I like that a lot. So this is our work unit. Can he work this straight away? That's what they recommend him. Hopefully we can. So I'm going to head straight towards this. Actually, got a, a pod over here which should unlock rewards for us, which is very nice. Okay, we're going to try to avoid the gas, but obviously we can't avoid it completely. We can eventually get rid of it, so that's very nice. I'm looking forward to that. That's under some technology. I can't remember which one it, which one it is. But we can. Um, we can do an old earth relic or a clinic. Um, I like the sound of getting some culture or soldiers. I'm not sure. Let's go. Let's go with the old earth relic first. Why not? And then choose our first research. Woo! Oh my god, I could talk about this for ages, but I'm going to try and ignore it and just pick which one I'm going to go with for now. Um, this one's quite good though because it's got a ultrasonic fence which will prevent aliens. So we've got physics, which allows us to do a observatory and launch complex. Oh, so I think we can launch uh, satellites and stuff. So that's going to be pretty essential later on. So you can see here, it's like a, it's not really a tree anymore. It's more of like a spider web. So say I want to go to generics and I want to research perhaps alien life forms. I have to research generics and then unlock this, but then this, this, this won't lead anywhere else. I have to go back up here and then go onto this bit. So this is like separate, like almost like subcategories, I guess, in some fashion. Um, but trying to decide where I'm going to go with first is going to be very difficult. Uh, if you want to go with ecology first, I reckon. I think so. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Screw it, let's go for it. Why not? Um, this first like game is going to be all about me sort of learning stuff and yeah. As you can probably tell. <laughs> so I've got my workers ready. So we're going to do a, I guess like a, a plantation. Perfect. Plus two food, minus one production. No, that's not too bad. What's this as well? Chop down the forest or construct a road. So we can build roads straight away. Awesome. Perfect. Right. So he was heading over here, wasn't he? Right, what have we got? Right. Uh, research pod searched. Awesome. So there are research pods. Inside the research pod, you have found a basic satellite still intact and enough rocket fuel for it to reach escape velocity. A free slower collector is ready uh, to launch from the city. Okay, awesome. How do we do that then? So is it here? Uh, we can, okay. So launch, orbit, do nothing, or sleep, okay. So I can, I think I can like research the map, as far as I can tell. So I probably want to research um, over here, perhaps. There we go. Oh God, it's aliens. Aliens have been spotted. Oh no. So aliens aren't the same as barbarians. They won't attack straight away. Um, but if you get like, near the nest or you or you attack them, they get pissed off. Um, pretty much. <laughs> as you can probably tell very, very soon. But this is the satellite, which is now up in the air, which is nice. That's keeping the lay of the land for me. As far as I'm aware, we can see like anything traveling between 
these three tiles constantly, which is nice. But for now, we are done with this turn. Let's move on. Let's move on. Next bit. Right, so my explorer. I'm going to send him back up over to this. He should be able to get this because it takes off 10 HP every turn, but he should be able to do it in like a couple of turns, so it's not too bad. Um, so what, what route should we take? Let's head back to the city and sort of head around this way. Try and save the life of that poor living soul. Right, I think we're done. It's, one, it's all beginning turns that are quite quick. I'll just go one turn, next turn. <laughs> to continue um stuff will be happening very soon don't worry the aliens are coming for us probably oh there's a pod over there as well damn it you know it's that exo mass as well right next turn it's a very quiet turn so far right let's head up here how are you doing how many turns do you need oh got to down the forest again okay that's fine i'm i'm willing to wait we need some more population very very soon actually Head up here. Pretty close to the settlement now, actually, which is nice. Next turn! I am so excited for this game. I want to see what this game has to offer. I'm very excited. Um, oh shit, some more aliens. <laughs> Let's head up here. They shouldn't attack us yet, like I said, but I am still worried. Right, so this is a quest um, a gift from home. Research, so I've got to try and find two pods and we've got like, a little reward every time we do the quests. So that's, that's nice. Um, find a clone is proposed. We should consider expanding. We should focus our effort on researching how to create new outposts. Okay. Um, so that's technology we need to re research next. Okay. We can do that. Uh, next turn. Do this. Ecology is still in 11 turns, which is quite a while yet. Let's head over here. What's this? Ooh. Offers me science. I could do with that. I've only got, I'm getting plus 6 science at the moment and plus 3 energy. No, only plus 2. Right, let's start this. So we don't get attacked. Right, let's take five turns. I hope they survive. <laughs> but they're, they're, they're rocking and rolling, which is good. Right, I think I'll choose my next production. Um, I'm going to go with... Oh, this, this is a difficult one. I'm going to go with Soldier. I think we're going to need them fairly soon. So focus on Soldiers. What the hell was that? What? Crash satellite discovered. What? You just explored to... So I'll, I can uncover a wall from that as well. Okay. So the satellite just dropped out of the air. Which is a tiny bit scary. I've, I've gone uh, forward a few turns as well. Um, not, 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 not actually a lot happened. Quest update. Um, a spacecraft plummeted through the atmosphere and crashed not too far away. Uh, where did it come from? Who built it? Was it their intention? Um, we'll find out in time once we investigate the wreckage. So it wants me to investigate that wreckage right there. Okay, perfect. See, I'm developing quite a few uh, quests and stuff already. Um, also, these are the victories. I'm not going to talk about them too much, but you can probably guess uh, domination is very similar to domination in Civ 5. It's just dominate, own everyone, kill every civilization, blah, blah, blah. Uh, contact is making contact with aliens and stuff and becoming friends i guess uh this is more like a science based these three like the promised lands all sort of sciencey based stuff um i will talk about them more as we go on right they're using they're still losing like 10 health every turn which is a slight worry oh i think this is our first our faction Ooh, culture developed the temple Hello. doors of the protectorate are open that's good to know um, should we do any deals and stuff? What would you have? Alliance probably can't read to that yet. Um, can I have all your signs, please? No, I'm, I'm joking. So the other factions will slowly sort of drop down. Um, they will start with different, um, like, I guess, rewards for, like, waiting. So I'm going to say goodbye to you. I'm sorry, I've got nothing else to say to you. But at least if someone else landed, which is always nice. Um, culture developed. So this is the virtues... Okay, we can, we can pick our first one. Ooh, very nice. Man, there's so much stuff to pick. Right, so this is all the virtues. All the top ones, industry, knowledge, might, and stuff. Um, so this is a bonus as well, so you get like a, a free virtue. Um, you get a plus 10% 10, 10, plus 10 production. So capital and plus 10% energy. Um, plus one technology. Um, 
So let's have a quick look at the top ones for now. Let's not focus too much on the whole the whole tree thing. <laughs> let's just focus on the top one. I think it's a little bit too much. Let's go with... So you can see like, this one's more based on like, uh, like production. This one's more based on science. Based on growth. This is more based on combat. Uh, let's go with... Let's go with knowledge. How to become knowledgeable. So I get so four more knowledge virtues until the next synergy bonus, which is 10% culture in every city. Every city. That sounds quite awesome. Um, five more until I unlock the, the free virtue. Okay. They're in it. That's my first one. Do I have any more? No, that's it. <laughs> so this is the upgrade unit screen. So you start with the basic soldier, which looks very basic. It's just literally like an astronaut with a gun, <laughs> which doesn't look very safe. Uh, and then you upgrade to a marine. Then you upgrade to like, I get, you got to try and decide where you lead. So purity is um, you wipe out everything, I guess. Just we own everyone. We kill everything, blah, blah, blah. Get out of my way. We are the human race. Uh, supremacy is what we're the human race. We dominate. We are the better race, I guess. Um, and um, harmony is work together, I guess, with the aliens. Become friends. I don't know, something along those lines. Be, be friendly. Um, but yeah. Now I'll try to choose a new production. I did go with go with soldier, won't we? Need new orders. Did that happen really quick? I just ordered that, didn't I? I'm so confused. Okay, whatever. We we'll go with it. Um, actually, I should have changed my production just now. What am I doing? Oh, so nice is landing. This can't be good. El pueblo unido de Sudamérica le da la bienvenida. Nice to meet you. The, the uh, United People of South America bid you welcome. Hello. Nice, nice to see you. Right, how's that coming along, actually? Your, your health is dropping dramatically. <laughs> um, right, let's need new orders. Have you, have you done? I think you've done. All right, let's get out of here quickly. Let's go. So instead of the soldiers, I'm going to build the clinic. We should try and get done ASAP. These soldiers are now ready and mobile. Um, I could go and do a little bit of exploring. I'm not sure. That satellite's still there. Beaming away at us, which is nice. Can they... Can the soldiers discover that? That'd be quite nice. Perhaps. Next turn, let's go. Right, how can we get your health back? Let's um, fortify the units until they're healed. Because they they're pretty damaged from the gas. I'm hoping they can... Oh, God. Okay. Aliens. Please don't attack me. I wonder if soldiers react... The aliens react differently when to... When Coyote learned perhaps, he was the sure. only one of his um, kind on the new planet. His no howl problem. echoed through the rifts and off the distant hills. Interesting. Right, let's research a new technology. It is sort of hint towards me perhaps going with this one, which I, I, I sort of agree with. Um, it starts trade up. Colonist as well. We need those pretty badly to make like, new cities. So I'm going to go with that for now. Return to map. Need some new orders. Can you go to here for me? We yes, we've done it. Woo! Right, so this inside the research pod, uh, blah, blah, blah. Basically gives us 16 research. I will take that. Thank you very much. There's a lot of aliens around here, which is slightly worrying me, to be honest. I'm going to head back this way. <laughs> so I didn't want to start an alien feud. Uh, next turn. What? This is like an alien as well. Is it done yet? It's done now, finally. As soon as I said that. Can we get some production up here? Do I need like, to research mines? I'm not sure yet. Uh, where could the explorers go? I guess we could head in this sort of, this sort of direction. Um, let's put you there first. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to ignore the gas. Get around the oh no, one second, we over here, don't we? The crash satellite, I forgot. So now we've got to decide what to do with this uh, this this relic. Um, this earth relic, this old earth relic. Do we leave it untouched or do we leave it to the public? Um, I'm gonna leave it to the public. I think everyone should see this 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 wreck, not this wreck, <laughs> this relic. Um, let's go with that open. So, oh, it gives us benefit. Okay, but plus one culture. Um, it makes it free for like maintenance. Okay, let's go with the culture. I'm fine with that. I'm good with that. Sweet. Awesome. So we should get a new virtue, hopefully quite soon. Should be nice. And let's go to the next turn. Right, so I've got a new virtue available. Um, so we've got these two we can go with. So this is um, 30 research science and finishing explorations. Um, that would be quite nice. Um, so each tile generates 0.25% culture for every population. Ooh, interesting. I'm gonna go with that one. Perfect. Sounds awesome. Thank you. Oh, I didn't collect it. There we go. I've, I've selected it now. I'm, I'm, I'm building this knowledge up. 
Right, I want you to head up freaking hills. Right, perfect. Next turn, go. Oh, we have had a bit of growth. Population has grown to four. Uh, we're pretty close to this crash site now. Uh, I'm not sure where to put these soldiers. Put you over here. What's that? Alien skeleton. Ooh. So every time you do like an um, exposition, you have to sort of go back to like your main city or like any city. And it'll give that sort of sort of module back, if that makes any sense. Let's go to the next turn. I'm flying through these early turns. Right, choose production. What the hell is that? Um, plus, oh, plus, that's, that'd be useful. All the ultrasonic fence for like, get, oh, what's this as well? Ooh. Uh, Church of Dawn Light provides plus one food and plus three culture to any city it establishes a trade route with. Okay. Um, this particular city provides four culture and any city that establishes a trade route. So that gives us four. I'm going to go with Church of the Dawn's Light. Because that gives us food and culture. Sweet. Is that good? Is that a good thing? I think we've done it. Sweet. Bullshit. What the hell was that? It's a freaking worm. It's a massive alien siege worm. So I'm guessing the siege worm will go will attack cities. If... That is not pleasant. Okay. Ooh, I'm getting nervous. Okay. There's quite some more soldiers soon. I think. The universe is either in progress <laughs> or in so. entropy. We Right, so I need to try and work out where we're going to put our next our next city. I think we should put it fairly close. Um, it's at least some of our resources around here, but it's, it's within three tiles, so perhaps um, like down here-ish, perhaps. This might be quite a good way to go with some more science would be nice. At least some of our resources. I'm going to head in this back this direction, because that worm is sort of slowly scaring me a little bit. Also got to decide what next, what, what next research we need to do. Um, let's go with engineering, I guess. Right, so my little worker has finished that little mine. Very nice. Let's go and get some more more food. I like some more food. Right, marines, not marines, soldiers. Um, head back here for now. Get a little bit nervous. Um, I want some, at least some defence around the city, uh, especially being our capital as well. So what I'm gonna do is end it there. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Civilization Beyond Earth. I love this game. I'm really excited to see what happens, more research stuff, some more crazy units, some more aliens. Um, so if I like reading simple mistakes, or I'm still learning. This is my this is my first go on the game. Definitely excited to see what happens though. Sorry if I like pronounced any words wrong or whatever. But thank you for watching. I'll see you guys later. Don't forget the giveaway in the description. And I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.